Synchronicity. I am big on days like that, you know, when it's like eight, eight, oh eight and stuff. I'm like, no, it's eight. Nice to play the lottery. I get excited about it. Trying to play for eleven and all. Been like blood. How red it is. Isn't blood crazy. Blood's just nutty. I'm so psyched to go eat today. Right. Well, I've been fasting. She's at the fast. So, I'm going to make an art video. I'm making an art video out of your purple hand in my blood. <laughs> <laughs> you did a really good, she did a really good job. <laughs> Thank you. As a fellow who was at one point pretty good with a needle himself, I can tell you, I always appreciate a good poke. <laughs> And a bad poker. Oh, no. That's not good. That's very sad. Well, you know, Stephen Tower was getting up there, so... Who yeah. Knows? Speaking of pokers, and former pokers, although I don't know if Steve was uh, an IV user ever. He yeah. sure as hell snorted the hell out of some dope, though. I'll tell you that. I saw him one uh, day. We thought we were going to see the Rolling Stone. It was Dr. J. Jones and the interns. And we were like, come on, Friday Night at the Paradise, unheard of band. It's got to be the Stones. It's when they were doing that back in early 80s. So we bought a bunch of tickets and we went, and it was Aerosmith, who I was a big, big fan of in high school. I went to see him a mess of times. But this was in there, we're crashing and burning drug phase. And, but it was in a very small club. The Paradise probably held a couple of hundred people. And so you could see everything that was happening, and he's up there. First of all, they had a keyboard player for the first time who was covering all of his background vocal parts. Every time they got to something like Back in the Saddle where you had to go, I'm back, this guy did the part. And then whenever there was, you know, a solo or something, he would just run back to the keyboard rig and bend <laughs> over and take a gigantic snarf. And you were like, you got to be kidding me, Steve, come on. I mean, you know, show off, whatever. I don't, it just is unnecessary. It can be done without. So, he, obviously, at that point. He looks bad, though. Oh, my God. And they sounded like absolute crap. And I love that band. They were a great, great band. They're still a great band, but they just don't write so swell anymore. But that they weren't a great band that year. And for a couple of years after. And then Joe left. That was right before Joe left the band. Couldn't blame him, man. They were stinking to join up. And for, you know, when you have a great band and then, you, then you're then you not a great band, <laughs> that's got to be painful. Look at all my blood. You did a fantastic job of getting all my blood out. Goodbye, blood. Good luck. I hope they find all the stuff that's wrong with me because of you. Plenty of it, too. You're filming.